and welcome back guys so we're gonna go ahead and continue playing some more Fallout New Vegas right now we're exploring Freeside and we are doing side quests we're doing Freeside currently hope everyone's enjoying the series make sure you hit the like button make sure you hit the subscribe button and let's go play some Fallout New Vegas What is it? Can't you see I want to be left alone with my friend here? Oh, that's different then. How can I help? I'll do anything to get the bastards that did this. As we were leaving the Wrangler, we must have taken a wrong turn and ended up in the squatter side of town. From out of nowhere, these big guys show up and start barking questions at us, wanted to know if we were locals. The kid there is about as proud as a local around here gets and started yelling back at him. Then all hell broke loose. Kid got the worst of it, sad to say. They were big guys, young too. No old geezers like me. Hell, none of them looked even half my age. I was mostly face down in the dirt, begging for my life when it happened, so I only got a quick look at him. I hope you find the bastards that true? Did the king really send? I don't really know what else I can add. There were a bunch of guys, better dressed than most freesiders, I guess. That help? Sorry I couldn't help more, especially since you're being so nice. Hey, wait, I just remembered something. I might have heard one of the guys that attacked us call another by name. We had just about had it when one of them said, Hey, Lou, we gotta go. At least I think he said Lou. It might have been something else. Now that I think of it, he said Lou something, something with a T. Tenant, that's what he called him, Lou Tenant. He probably... And I've been aside from protecting. I've been around long enough to observe the patterns of human behavior. Hey, who doesn't enjoy a little pinch? They already have that pig McCaffrey working for them. Do they need another guard? Uh, I've escorted my share of idiot tourists around Freeside. Too much trouble for what it pays. I'm all boot knives and leather, friend. And a ghoul besides. What kind of weirdo wants what I've got? Weirdos into bullwhips and necrosis, huh? <sighs> Doesn't sound half bad. What am I thinking? I'm no whore. And I ain't about to hand my ass over to some penny ante hustler like he owns me. do have a damn good selection of hooch over at the Wrangler. If I get to choose my customers, if I get to be a little rough with them, if my cut is fair, and if I get that discount, that just might work. 
Tell the Garretts I'll stop by to work out terms. Are you here to drop off medical supplies? Leave them with the rest in the middle of the court. Rates of injury and illness in Freeside are very high. Supplies don't last long. Medex, Radaway, and Fixer are Freeside essentials. I can't pay you for any supplies you bring in, but I could discount the charge for our services. So far, the Crimson Caravan won't cut us a deal. If you can convince them or some other merchant to work with us, I'll discount supplies to you. You might ask around at Mick and Ralph's, or go see the Garretts, though I suspect they're too busy poisoning Freeside to help it out. Just come see me when you've got some supplies to turn in. What do you want to talk about? be impressed with what they're doing here. Got something good for me? Is it a dress? Hey, 
I can't really move now, but I'll follow you in spirit. Have you found anything out? Bunch of soldier boys, huh? They usually don't come around these parts since their big base is on the other side of the strip. If they're coming over here now, it's gotta be for a reason. I didn't want to believe the rumors that they're looking to take over Vegas, but now, if something big is going down, I'm sure rumors of it will have spread. Ask around, particularly in the squatter areas where the NCR folk hang. You might also mosey on over to the Mormon fort and chat Julie Farkas up. The followers tend to be in the know about these things. Just don't ask her what to do about it. She'll probably ask you to hug someone or something.
I've got my eye on you. Welcome back. Interesting. Well, you're gonna need to speak with my brother, James. He handles all of the trading contracts and just... See? Ooh, got something good for me? Is it a dress? Welcome back. What? Caps up front. Another satisfied customer. Welcome back. What? Really now? This is news. We could possibly supply what they need, but they would need to supply us in kind. They have the tech know-how to make our stills work more efficiently. Pure alcohol means we can get our customers drunk quicker. Getting our customers drunk quicker means more caps spent at the tables and stuffing slots, if you know what I mean. Plus, the extra alcohol can serve as surgical disinfectant for their needs. The followers are a good lot. They've stitched up our boys in the past. Good. We can supply them with all the medics they need. For the fixer, we'll only be able to send over some basic drug components. We're not in the business of getting people off drugs, so we don't really dabble in that side of things. The followers should be able to whip some up with what we have available, though. They just need to agree to fix up our stills and keep them maintained, plus cover the cost for raw materials needed to make the alcohol. Imagine that! What's his name and when's he start? A she, huh? Well, I guess the customer who made that request can't get everything he wants. Hell, who knows? He might not even notice the difference.
got it, partner. You come for a piece, haven't you? Welcome to New Vegas. Consider me your personal welcome party. Now hear this. The head honcho of New Vegas, Mr. House, is itching to make your acquaintance. Just head for the Lucky 38. It's the big old tower shaped like a roulette spinner. Yeah! So the Garrett sent you to track me down. What a joke. Now why the hell should I do... I've been killing scum twice your... Well, that sounds like a bit of a bargain. I get to walk free with the Garrett's thinking I'm dead. Sure, you can have my hat. I can always buy another with the caps I've got left. It would have been more fun fighting it out, though. See you later, kid. So when we come back, we'll be going into the Lucky 38 and get that all set up. We're not going to do the Mr. House quest, but we're going to get our stuff stored in there. So when we do Yes Man and we get to that point where we want to start doing that kind of questing, that we can. Uh, so make sure you hit the like button, make sure you subscribe button, and I'll see you again in the next video.